Hello and welcome to another video. Today I happy to represent and show you my upgraded charger board. As you can see on a frame right now. It's a few changes that I make for this board from the previous version. I give a link on the description below to the video of the previous version. But today I want to show you my upgraded one, which means that I added and take off some parts. And all these thanks for the 3D printer I got just a week ago. And I start to print some parts. I'm going to show you the parts and I also going to show you uh, how you can charge all the batteries and headset and watch on this charger board. Let's get into it. As you can see here, this is a charger for my GH4 camera. And you can see the name. I 3D print the name uh, in the 3D printer. So I give it the name. If I want to disconnect the charger, I just have to slide it to the left disconnect the AC power cable and take it with me wherever I go if I need to I use the camera on a project. Uh, right under that you can see two charger also give a name with a 3D printer. One is for the GoPro Hero 5 and the other one is for the Sony A7 battery. Uh, the circle in the middle with the two screws, this is also 3D printed to cover the holes that the cable go out from. And the cable move between one charger to another, so you need only one cable, you just connect it to the charger and then you can charge uh, the batteries of this charger. Uh, up here, I actually divide the cable between three items. And the cold shoe I put my arsenal, camera assistant, uh, I print a cold shoe mount in a 3D printer, so I can have it on. Next to it, it's a Icon X headset from Samsung. I put it on the shelf, small shelf that I also 3D print. And down here, it's a charger for my Atomus Ninja batteries. And again, I charge uh, using one cable, move between them. Not so often I have to charge everything at the same time, so I can move between them. And this is a 3D printer also that I print a cable holder, so I can have a long cable of my headset uh, just mounted on this. This I designed myself. Down here. I have my Logitech G933 headset, also 3D mounted headset holder. I think it's my first 3D printed item. And the cable under, you can see right here the black cable connected from under. I can connect it to the headset and charge the headset. This is my Gear S3. Watch, Frontier, also piece that I print in a 3D printer. Uh, I can just have the watch on it, take it off, I can disconnect the charger and take it with me. And after I show you all this, I'm going to show you the shelf, small shelf that I built right on the side here for the battery. The one on the top, it's a GoPro Hero 5, two batteries for the Ninja Atomus, three batteries, place for three batteries for the Sony A7. And I don't know if you hear the background sound, it's the printed of the battery for my GH4. So this is on the way. Uh, yeah, 
yes, this is uh, my charger board. Very, very nice. I renew also the paper, so everything looks white and nice. And on the future, I have some few spots that I can add more here and maybe something small charger here. But for now, everything also can be taken off. This battery for the Atomos is a little heavy, so you put it on, use the strap to attach it. And these two, you can see you put the batteries, if you want to use them on a go, you can dismount the charger. Also this and this one also, you put the charger like this and then use put the battery on. And this is how you charge it, so you can use it on the go also. I hope you like the idea of my charger board for all the batteries, shelf, including shelf for all the batteries that are already charged. This is my charger board. If you have any question, if you need any 3D files that you want out of this uh, 3D uh, printed items that I have, let me know in a comment below and I can send you the files of each part and you can print it for yourself. Until then, stay creative and I will see you on my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.